All right, in this geek tip, I'm going to show you quickly how to resolve the black screen with white mouse cursor that m you may come up against in Windows 10. Now, sometimes you boot your system up, it'll boot up perfectly fine, and it comes up to a black screen with white mouse cursor. And basically, what that means is the GUI, the graphic user interface, failed to initialize, failed to start up. So I'm going to show you how to quickly get the GUI come back up. So real quick, I'm going to crash the GUI right now inside of Windows 10. So I'm going to go into Task Manager. I'm going to go Details. And I'm going to crash Explore. Explore is the actual program that displays the desktop taskbar start menu. So there we go. Basically, we now have a black screen with white mouse cursor. So since I am in a virtual machine, I cannot do a, you know, physically hit the control alt delete buttons, but that's what you would want to do. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to insert a control alt delete into my virtual machine. Now we come up with the Windows 10 lock screen. From the lock screen, we're going to go into task manager. Normally, if you've never gone into Task Manager, this is the view you're going to be presented with. So what we need to do is we need to click on More Details. Then I'm going to go up here to File, Run New Task. We're going to type in Explore. As you can see, I've already got it in here. So just like when we crashed the GUI, we we shut down explore now we're going to start it back up and now we have our desktop start button start menu taskbar and we're all ready to go so for more geek tips go on over to geeksofphoenix.com so that's it for today have a great day and stay safe